The Mini Oven is a compact and low-cost reballing unit, perfect for R&D and low-volume production. It will eliminate production floor downtime, with no interruption to the reflow oven just to reflow a single BGA. The Mini Oven cuts costs and lead time by not having to outsource. The Start button begins the heating process and confirms options within the menu, similar to an Enter button. Up and down buttons scroll through menus and modify parameters. The stop button terminates the heating process and functions as back and exit. The mini oven uses a unique heating concept of IR and convection. The IR heat comes from below the glass plate. Inlets located in the back of the oven feed hot air from beneath the glass plate to the inside of the heating chamber. As an option, nitrogen gas can be used to reduce oxidation. The temperature is monitored using the internal sensor. As soon as the process is finished, the fan starts the cool-down phase. Martin offers standard and customized masks. Ensure that the QFN mask is free from any residual solder and flux residue. Precisely place the component into the matching mask with the contacts pointing downwards. Press the QFN firmly against the mask. Make sure that the frame clicks into place. Check that all the openings are consistently filled. The use of a magnifying glass or microscope may be required. Any excess solder paste should be removed. After additional cooling time, the fixture can be taken out of the mini oven. Carefully remove the component from the mask with a pair of tweezers. It can be helpful if this is done when the mask is still warm. That way, the flux residue between component and mask is less likely to stick.